Yo, I'm back with another Edible Futures Market Garden Lowdown. So, if you've watched my videos before, you know that this is our regular field. However, there is this side of the site. See that crow that's got a dead mouse there? Of the fighting over it. But anyway, this is the other side of the site. This is uh, what's known as the Sunburst Garden. Uh, this part of uh, Grow Wilder uh, the last few years has been run by volunteers and uh, you know uh, business groups that come in and it's set out like a nice allotment kind of type place however me and Humphrey at Edible Futures are going to be taking this on this year uh, due to the fact no volunteers can come and work it so we're taking on all this space however we want to grow a bit more intensively than what's been going on here so we're turning it into a market garden style just like ours on the other side of the field we're going to have street crop rows going between one path here one path the other side and i'm not sure how many beds we're going to fit in yet but uh the first job is i'm doing here now clearing out all the wood chip paths i'm going to be clearing out all the wood chip taking out all the bed edges these big holes here were where the gooseberry bushes were. I dug them out last week and that's why my arms have been cut up all week, which was nice. Uh, but that was the hardest stuff to dig out. But all of this is going to be going. So we'll see how much I can get done today. So I'm bringing all the wood chip off the path this is not a lot of managed to get so far uh, this is normally a growing tunnel however uh, because the business has changed very fast in the last couple of weeks uh, grow wilder and now going to be using this as a propagation space for all their new seedlings that they're going to be selling online so uh, check them out at grow wilder and buy yourself some nice plants good thing about all the wood chip that we've got here is we've got loads of mycelium in there check that out it's the internet of the soil Humphrey Humphrey had left me all morning to do all the hard labour work and he went down where Aberystwyth? Carmarthen Carmarthen and picked us up a bunch of scrap metal <laughs> Scrap metal. It's, it's not scrap metal. So the guy had a forklift and we have no forklift. <laughs> so this is gonna be fun. <laughs> So today has consisted so far of moving a lot of wood chip and a lot of heavy equipment. Now I need to put the rotavator in because it's raining. So much stuff. So a little update on what I've been up to this afternoon. I'm not being filming just because a bit of a lot going on. So as you can see here, we have all these pallets with these seedlings on. And yesterday, this pallet here decided to snap its strings, which is, we were expecting it. We've been meaning to redo all the strings. So I've just retied all these on. This one fell down with all of these uh, squash that I sowed yesterday. So I had to redo all of them, which was not the most fun job, but Hopefully all these should be supported now. Now the reason we do this is for one, because we're lacking in space, and two is uh, things like squash, mice will love to eat the seeds. So if you just put that on a normal table, there's a chance you're gonna come back down the next day and all your seeds will be eaten by the mice. 
and so what else we've been doing is we've been moving all these plants in these are going to be going in here next week so we'll be ripping up all of this sorrel and that'll be the cucumbers that you see here uh, we've also got loads of nasturtiums the nasturtiums are basically we do put a few of the leaves in our salad bags but it's mainly for the uh the flowers so it adds a lot of color to your salad bag and then this side we've got all of our tomatoes and that's going to be going up and hopefully the spring onions should just be nice when we pull them next week now so we'll rip that out but we're currently just running out of a lot of space in our other polytunnel where we do all our sowing of seeds because uh, normally we sow enough seeds for this site but currently we're but doubling up more than doubling up on the amount of plants that we're sowing uh, for our new site so that's why it's starting to look a bit wild and packed in here but it's exciting so yeah going to go and sow some more seeds now just gonna get a table gotta get a table because what are we doing now gonna sow some seeds is your career spring onions Ooh. There you go, day on the farm. Do you have fun? Yeah. Sowing some seeds. Catch you next time on the trials and tribulations of edible futures.